Hello all you Pixel people, I am Pixel and yesterday I released a Dirty Talk episode on the bolt action sniper rifles in Dirty Bomb. And to be honest the video has gone down quite well which was a little bit surprising, I thought I would get a little bit of hate. A lot of people don't like you touching their snipers and all that kind of jazz. But um, what I did notice is that on Reddit and in the comment section for the video, a few people were actually asking why I was focusing on the bolt action sniper rifles instead of focusing on stuff like the PDP because apparently the PDP is probably the most overpowered weapon right now. And so I decided to actually jump back in game and actually play for maybe four or five hours with the PDP and the bolt action sniper rifles and try and come up with a conclusion to whether the PDP is overpowered or not. And to be honest, I think that the PDP is very strong, but I'm not really at the skill level right now with, with the PDP to uh, comment fully, I, I don't believe. I, I think I've still got a long way to go to actually become a PDP master, and uh, from the sounds of the comments, there's a lot of people out there which are totally wrecking it up with that weapon, so I don't want to make a Dirty Talk episode just in case I um, change my mind later on, because I, I try and make the Dirty Bomb... Um, the Dirty Talk episodes, very kind of, not only informative, but a, a breakdown of my opinions once I feel like I'm getting close to mastering a certain aspect of the game. And I certainly haven't got there yet when it comes to the PDP. I think there's an awful lot of work to be done on my half. But um, I have to be honest, I did play for a few hours, like I did mention, and... I, I started to see the strength that the PDP had to offer, and yet I didn't really think it was overpowered. However, I do have to admit that I think there may be something else going on in my mind which is making me feel like the PDP isn't all that strong, and I think a lot of it comes down to I just don't find it a fun weapon to use. I actually do prefer the bolt action sniper rifles. I think they give a lot more like kinetic feedback. Like you fire that trigger, you hear that ding, and you know that the player is dead unless you're actually shooting versus like a rhino or something. So you've got that kind of confidence in the kill, and uh, it's that one shot kind of. It makes you feel like a badass, right? The PDP just, in my opinion, right now feels a little bit spammy unless you're going versus multiple light uh, characters that you can actually shoot down in one or maybe two shots. Um, it, it feels amazing when you actually get a couple of shots on the uh, auras and stuff that are running around. I won't deny that whatsoever. So I do think that the PDP does have um, a lot of strength. And I can totally understand why some people would call it overpowered. And there's a possibility that I may consider it to be overpowered eventually. But right now today, I, I don't know. I still think like the bolt action sniper rifles are a little bit better than it in public play. I can completely imagine... That uh, in competitive play where players are running down set paths and people are spawning together and like most of the time grouped up, why the PDP would be so like devastating to a full team, right? Especially when you mix that in with a red eye and his smoke grenade ability to just hide in the smoke and actually see five people running towards you and just start spamming shots and getting a few kills. I can imagine that being very strong and probably a little bit of a problem to be honest. That splash damage should maybe look at tweaking in some way. But what I did find is that there were many situations that I would go against an enemy or multiple enemies with the bolt action sniper rifle and feel like I won and I would have not won had I had the PDP. And I'm sure there were a few situations where it was vice versa. So I had the PDP and I felt, wow, it's a good job I had that and not the sniper rifles, otherwise I would have lost. But generally, I did feel like there was more clutch situations with the bolt action snipers than there was with the PDP. That said, I was trying to play the PDP really aggressively. I, I suppose that's just my play style, so maybe that's what I'm doing wrong. Um, where with a sniper rifle, as long as you get that headshot, you can play it as aggressively as you like, and it seems to just uh, work fairly well. So that's the reason why I did focus on the bolt action sniper rifles in that episode of Dirty Talk. I will more than likely uh, release a video on the PDP once I've got a little bit more experience with it, and providing that I actually think there's a problem with it whatsoever. Um, but until then, I just want to say thank you very much for watching. If you haven't watched that video, I will leave a link in the description and I'll stick up an annotation now somewhere so you can go and watch that. And uh, yeah, thank you for the support, guys. I will be doing some more Dirty Bomb content very soon. And as always, like the video if you like the video and slap that subscribe button for some more PC gaming goodness. I've been Pixel, and until next time, bye-bye.